Okay, so my name is Cheryl Glath, and I'm a pickleball player, and I compete at tournaments. And why I decided to do hypnosis is that I thought it could help me because when I go to a tournament, especially at the beginning, the first few games, I'm very nervous, um, and uh, it affects my performance. So um, I did it so that I could go to a tournament and not be nervous and, and be able to play at my optimum level. Uh, do you remember the screening? And if so, what did you think about that? I thought that you asked great questions and, um, and you brought in additional um, information, thoughts that I hadn't really had um, that kind of gave me a better understanding of things. Um, and I, I was a little bit, um, I, I didn't really understand hypnosis. Am I going to be asleep? Am I like at the mercy of somebody I don't know? Because for me, this was a leap of faith. I didn't know you and, and you didn't get referred to me. I actually found you on the internet. Um, but I decided to take the leap of faith and I'm very glad that I did. Yeah. Great. So what were the results of your sessions? How's your pickleball game? So um, I did some minor round robins, and then last weekend I did a, a major tournament, and uh, or at least for me, what I consider a major tournament. And I found that um, I, I was a little bit nervous um, at times leading up to the tournament, but not nearly as nervous as I was before. And then as I went into play, uh, I really, the nervousness was gone. Um, I was much more relaxed, uh, and that made it easier to enjoy um, my passion. And um, it really it really did accomplish what I was hoping to accomplish. Uh, for one thing, it gives me more insight um, and tools to work with. So uh, one of the things that occurred to me after our last session, um, we talked about it a little bit during the session, um, was um, sometimes you'll miss a couple shots and then you'll you'll get in your head and, and you your, your game just goes downhill and you need to reset that. You need to, I think what, what you used in the session is we're in the future right now, the past is dissolved and and I need anchors out on the court to do that. It, you know, taking a step forward, taking a deep breath, putting on my pickleball shoes, um, you know, touching my wrist, things, things that I can do on the court um, in order to come into that present moment and not be, um talking in my head about you know how my shots are deteriorating and I'm not doing well instead I, I'm right now right back to where I'm at yeah so if you had this to do over again would you do it 100 percent and yes, would you and I'm going to recommend it to other people as well yeah fantastic anything else you want to say about your experience doing hypnosis for sports improvement well um, I think that it, it can help you bring more happiness and more joy to your sports experience. Um, and, um, whether or not you win or lose, obviously you're happier when you win, <laughs> but, um, you know, that's an important, um, goal that during our discussions, it occurred to me because, you know, you're so focused on, you know, I want to hit the ball, right. And I want to keep my eyes on the ball and I want to you know, win and I want to do but you forget really the point of it all. And that is to be in joy. Um, so yeah, I, I, I think um, I'm probably going to evolve from where we are and um, expand on the purpose. So my initial purpose was, you know, to not be nervous. I may come up with new purposes um, for uh, additional hypnosis ses sessions to help with my actual performance um, in specific ways. Yeah.